Hello and welcome to a let's play of L.A. Noir. We're going to be playing Buyer Beware. Every there's the case that makes you. Gives you that leg up. Gets you recognized as the shining new star in the squad. The case that you solve that shows that you have the gumption, the gung-ho, the get-up-and-go to make you stand out from your average rank-and-file patrolman. This could be the one goal. So this is the first case where you're a patrolman and uh, I've got to try and solve this LAPD! Crime. Could you stand clear of the body, please? Has anyone called an ambulance? We've called an ambulance and the police, but I'm afraid he's dead. That sucks for him. Okay, stand further back and move along. It's your choice, but make it quick, people. Hey, Cole. You got here quick. My beat crosses 7th Street. Okay. You're first reporting, then. We'll get a perimeter going and move the crowd on. You better see what you can find out before the homicide dicks show up. I'll be with you in a moment. All right, here it goes. Right, let's have a look. Everybody, here. stay back. Let us do our job. All right, let's check out this body. Broad daylight, crowded street. Now I've seen everything. Okay, so yeah, we need to check everything. So let's have a look in here. Do 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 do. Bank of Arcadia. Name C. Gadetta. Apartment five. Pearl earrings. What's that? That's the article. Retail price. Payments made. Uh, Okie dokie. Layaway ticket. Okay. C. Galetta. Layaway receipt. Pearl earrings. Made out to Bank of Arcadia. Okay. Uh, that's something. Anything else? Let's have a look in here. Yeah, I think. A bit. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Nothing. Uh, over here. Uh, nothing. Okay. Alright, alright. Can we do anything else? Ah! Yep, there we go. There's the head. Okay. Wee, wee. Ah, there's like a small cracking sound. Oh, God, that's disgusting. Yeah. Will this make it into okay. the paper? I think I saw something flashing over here. Yep, there we go. What's that? There we go. Shell cases. These look like 32s. Okie dokie. Let's put them down then. Let's have a look over here. Dun, da, da, da. All right, all right. Yes, it's a dead person. <laughs> FN Browning, serial number zero one one three eight. Might need to run it by a gun store. Eagleson's gun store is a couple blocks from here. Alrighty then. I guess we'll be going there soon. This is a crime scene. All of you, move along. Move along. Move along. Anyone we can talk to. This guy in the crowd thinks he saw something, Cole. You better take a statement. Oh, because it's you who looked forward. Yeah. Advice? Sir, I'm Officer Phelps. What exactly did you see? I heard the shots. I thought it was a car backfiring. Uh, I saw a girl run at the shoe store. If you were right. twice as smart, you'd still be stupid. Wow. Speak to the witness before homicide arrives, Phelps. If you think she's lying, don't be afraid to get forceful. Verbally, of course. And don't accuse her of anything without proof. Lawyers love that shit. And if you're sure she's straight up, try the general approach. See what you can coax out of her. Okie dokie. Cops. Let's give it a shot then. Be something big, right? Don't you people have anything better to do? Nope. Uh, can I can I help you, sir? Uh... I'm Officer Phelps, okay. miss. I'm here about the shooting. Did you know the victim? <laughs> he was my boss. Mr. Gage. Mr. Gage's first name? Everett. And you are? Galleta. Clovis Galleta. Okay. All right, Clovis. What do you know? Shoe store clerk, eyewitness to murder of Everett Gage. I guess we're going to be asking about eyewitness account. Okay. Let me do it. 
Okay. Do you think you could tell me exactly what happened, miss? I look around the shops at lunch. I was in a store when Mr. Gage, my boss, bursts in yelling that I'm late on my lunch. And? We came back. I was angry. I walked in front. I heard shots. I turned and saw Mr. Gage fall. <laughs> hmm. Right. Okay, she's proper sketchy. Uh, press Y to accuse the victim of lying. Can I just view my notebook? Shooting, fatal sidewalk shooting incident, one male victim. There we voucher. Um, 32 shell casings and an FM Browning handgun. Uh, uh, is that evidence I can use? Was he shot in the front or in the back? Fatal sidewalk shooting incident, one male victim. Uh, it doesn't say, that's really annoying. I'm pretty sure she's lying because she's looking as sketchy as anything. You're lying, Miss Coletta. You know what happened and why. You're going to tell me. There's nothing to tell. I've done nothing wrong. How can you prove different? <laughs> Receipt for pearl earrings made out on a bank of Arcadia. Ah. Uh, Thank you, Arcadia, to see Galetta. Mm. I'm not exactly sure. Shit. Shoot. Uh, I'm a bit confused. So we got. Uh, that doesn't do anything for us. That doesn't do anything for us. That's possible, and the fatal sidewalk shooting incident possible if he's shot from the front. This one has only got is out to see Galera, so I don't think that helps. Why are you just staring at me like that? Oh, I've done that. nothing wrong. Hmm. Yeah, all right. Okay. Shoot. How dare you accuse me of lying? Frick. God, I think you're horrible. A man is dead, Miss Galetta, and it's a criminal offense to lie to a police officer. I will take you downtown. Get out! Get out right now! Send in one of the other policemen if you must, but I won't say another word to you. Bowls. That sucks. Hmm. We have the murder weapon? No murderer. The girl saw it all, but she clammed up on me. We could trace the gun. Eagleson's gun store is a couple blocks from here. You thinking what I'm thinking? Tate, maintain the perimeter. All right, away we go. Something big, right? Okay. All right, I'm gonna drive there out. Why? There we go. Select the next stage. There we go. Okay. Whilst we're going for a drive, I have a quick chat. Uh, so, if anyone's been watching my channel. Uh, then uh, you probably have, you could have seen um, that I was doing the um, the stalker what game. What did I tell you about going too hard on the witness? She's a store assistant, not a prisoner of war. Is that supposed to be funny? I'm just saying that sometimes you need to pour some sugar on these broads. A little bedside manner can go a long way. And since when are you the expert? We got the murder weapon, didn't we? You shouldn't dole it out if you can't take it, Phelps. She was a looker, though. Tell me I'm wrong. No wonder you're suddenly so obsessed with bedside manner. Ooh, sorry, mate. Um, but you yeah, gonna leave the street light there. intact on this block? Right, sure. Um, yeah, as I say, I was playing uh, Stalker in my last game playthroughs. The reason I was, um, I've stopped doing that is it's just, it's just impossible. Uh, I was trying to do a kind of. Uh, playing the game through on the hardest difficulty setting, uh, let's play, but oh my god was it hard. So I kind of uh, gave up on that and uh, I'm going to be doing a let's play of the XCOM game when it comes out, the XCOM uh, Enemy Unknown, which is coming out very very soon. Can't wait for that thing, it's going to be awesome. 
Uh, but uh, in the meantime, I thought I'd do a little bit more of a casual game. I haven't played this game for uh, quite a long time. I, I played through it, I, I guess it was when it came out quite a while ago. Uh, I kind of enjoyed it, but I thought this would be good just to do the main cases uh, until XCOM comes out, and then we'll be I'll be going through on that. So. Uh, this is the first case, and I'm already screwing it up by saying the wrong things to the old lady. So, but luckily, I think this one we can't really fail. What can I do you for? Officers Phelps and Dunn, sir, Wilshire Division. We need you to trace a serial number. Sure. What's the make and model? FN Browning, model 1922. The serial number is 01138. You don't say. Well, I didn't sell it. Europeans love them, but it's pretty rare you find one over here. Although I did have one in here a couple of weeks back. Remember the owner? Yeah. Kalu. Edgar Kalu was his name. Thing looks like it had never been fired, but he brought it in here for cleaning anyway. Then he bought a box of cartridges and he left. Do you know where we can find Mr. Kalu? Told me he was on his lunch break. Said he worked at Hartfield's jewelry store just up on Broadway. Thanks for your help. All right, so we've got where the location of the suspect is. Let's go find him. Do -do 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 -do. Here we go. So yeah, I'm I'm really excited for the XCOM game that's coming out soon. Um, I don't know if anyone has been interested in it or following it at all, but it looks pretty awesome. Um, kind of similar to the old. If you're from Europe, then UFO enemy unknown. If you're from America, XCOM defense. I think school but man oh man it's gonna be awesome but for the meantime let's just play a bit of LA Noir so this is where the suspect works let's go and officer, see if we can get some information can I interest him. you in a new watch officer Cole Phelps are you Edgar Kalu uh no uh Mr. Kalu is out back he said he'd lie down I'll buzz him for you Du -du -du. Bullshit. Son of a bitch! Go, Cole, go! Hurry, officer! He's getting away! Wow, well, even his own staff doesn't like him that much. Hello! Get back here! RT is to aim. What? Right. Let's see if I can catch him. Right, I want a straight where I can do this. Too late, Kalu! Okay. Come on. There we go. Yeah, we got him. Awesome. Stop or I will shoot! Yeah, these action scenes are pretty crappy in this game, actually. It's definitely the investigations. Edgar Kalu! You're under arrest for the murder of Everett Gage. But man, they really did a really good job in this game of uh, really capturing emotion in the, the case uh, that the makes faces. you, and the case that breaks you, the one you never solve, the one that keeps you awake at night, the case that gnaws at your guts and ruins your marriage, the case that keeps you propping up a bar as you relive the what ifs, the might have beens, the half leads, and the half truths, the case that other cops murmur about whenever you walk past. The case you never, ever discuss. God's mill may grind slowly, but it grinds finely, son. I I'm hear it's you who not done a factor from the shooting yesterday. Yes, sir. Then tell me, Boyle. I hear you're quite the climber, a man of initiative. How would you like a chance at smiting this man with the sword of justice? You're asking me to, to conduct the interview, sir? I am, young Phelps. You've only been with us a short time, and you've assembled yourself a stellar arrest record. Not to mention the fine work you did in the war, sending heathens back to the hell they came from. But I'm curious as to whether you can turn your hand to interrogation. It takes a certain animal cunning, lad. Do you think you might be ready for that? Yes, sir. I think I am. Good man. You need many things for a conviction, young Phelps. A motive? Opportunity, hard evidence, and best of all, a confession. If you fail in the former, you can always use a modicum of violence to obtain the latter. Sounds fun. How are you feeling, lad? Fine, sir. Very good. The evidence is overwhelming. 
May the cat eat him and the cat be eaten by the devil. Bring me a confession, young Phelps. This is your chance. Don't fail me. All right. Stress head. Has my lawyer arrived yet? I want to see my lawyer. A lawyer can't help you, Mr. Kalu. You shot a man dead in cold blood. You're going to have to pay for that. Right, let's ask about that then. Shooting incident. Let's talk about the shooting. Do you deny shooting Everett Gage? I'm a businessman. I, I run a jewelry store. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm sure my lawyer can clear all this up. Bullshitter. Look at those twitches. Lie. You deny owning a Browning pistol. Serial number 01138. I owned a gun, yes, but 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 it was stolen in a burglary a couple years ago. You can't prove I used my gun on Gage. Hmm. Oh, the murder weapon was serviced. There we go. Testifies to Kalu servicing Browning's pistol. La 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 la. You had the gun cleaned and bought a new box of ammunition. The store owner remembers you and where you worked. Is that so? It's amazing what the nebishes will recall when it suits them. Hmm. Possible religious motive. Let's change the subject. You fasting for Yom Kippur, Mr. Kalu? Yeah, let's change the subject, you going motherfucker! How about baseball? You're not denying you're a Jew, Mr. Kalu. This is America. It's not Germany. It's not a crime. Some people don't like Jews, Mr. Kalu. Yeah, and I guess you're one of them. Gage hated Jews, didn't he, Mr. Kalu? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Which you ass motherfuckers lying. Lying, Kalu. I think you lent Gage money and he owed you payment. I don't know what you're talking about. I think you do. Layaway voucher. Pearl earrings made out on Bank of Arcadia to see Galetta. I think that's the one that we need. I'm done with you. Go or flap not. your gum somewhere else. Oops, I want my lawyer. I've just got to keep my mouth shut and watch you run around in circles. We're done. Unless you want to keep making a schmuck of yourself. Ah, bollocks. You disappoint me, Cole Phelps. Get back in there and raise some lumps, boy! I need a confession! Ugh. God, no escape. Hello again. Has my lawyer arrived yet? I want to see my lawyer. You asked that before. A lawyer can't help you, Mr. Kalu. You I shot a before. man dead in cold blood. You're going to have to pay for that. <sighs> shooting victim. Let's talk about the shooting. Do you deny shooting Everett Gage? I'm a businessman. I, I run a jewelry store. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm sure my lawyer can clear all this up. Well, you know what I'm going to say next, because you know I'm going to get this one right. Do 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 do. You look shifty as a fucker. You deny owning a Browning pistol. Serial number 01138. I owned a gun, yes, but 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 it was stolen in a burglary a couple years ago. You can't prove I used my gun on Gage. Uh, murder weapon serviced. That's the one, isn't it? You had the gun cleaned and bought a new box of ammunition. The store owner remembers you and where you were. Do we Is that so? Thing? It's amazing what the nebishes will recall when it suits them. Okay, here we go. Possible religious mood. Let's change the subject. You fasting for Yom Kippur, Mr. Kalu? Yeah, let's change the subject, you going motherfucker! How about baseball? You're not denying you're a Jew, Mr. Kalu. This is America. It's not Germany. It's not a crime. Some people don't like Jews, Mr. Kalu. Yeah, and I guess you're one of them. Gage hated Jews, didn't he, Mr. Kalu? I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, screw it. I'm going to use intuition because I'm a little bit confused. Yeah. Remove an answer. There we go. Alright, so it's not a lie. Okay, he looked really shifty before. He still looks pretty shifty. I thought that was a lie. Oh well. Doubt. You left wing leaning parasite. You expect me to sit here and listen to your drivel? You call me that? 
You sit there and you call me those names, you goddamn gory putt snatcher. You and that stump Gage. Why did you do it, Mr. Kalu? Gage. He's in the Chamber of Commerce. He's in with all those momsers. He blocked every proposal I ever put forward. Kike this and kike that. He's been trying to ruin my business for years. Edgar Kalu, I'm charging you with the first degree murder of Everett Gage. Booyah. I respect your beliefs and your right to hold them. I hope for your sake the jury can commute to murder in the second degree. May God have mercy on you, sir. Well, sucks to be you, doesn't it? Masterfully done, Officer Phelps. That's a bit of a change of character. It is just Officer Phelps. Isn't it, lad? Yes, sir. Then let me have a word with the Chief of Police, young Phelps. The department needs heroes. A shining, honest face the public can admire. I applaud a man with your talent for unwavering justice. Back to your duties for now, Boyle. But here's a piece of advice. Get yourself two suits, get them pressed. You'll be needing them. Cheers, my dears. Awesome. All right, there we go. I guess that's the first case finished. Nice. You did all right there, I guess. Let's see. The offer displays sound investigative techniques, service weapon proficiency, and peak physical conditioning. Keen interrogation instincts. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so we'll be continuing uh, L.A. Noir later with the next case and trying to solve that one. Oh, I hope you enjoyed just following this one and just some of my ramblings and things. But, uh, yeah, thank you very much. We'll see you later and uh, take care. Goodbye.